One half of the daily double of a great record-breaking day and night. Ricky Henderson in the day, stolen bases. Nolan Ryan, yet another no-hitter in the evening. Bill Patrick has a look at Nolanometry. It is the newest math. We call it Nolanometry. On any given sports day, 939 is likely to be a titanic, nigh unapproachable figure. It dwarfs numbers like 4 for 4, or 8 and 2 thirds, or 417 in his last 10 games. It would be the biggest number on most days, enough to make a man unquestioned king of the sports world for a healthy spell. But Nolan Ryan has a unique perspective on numbers. Nolanometry is the integration of history and math. Consider the logic. Seven does not equal simply seven. Seven equals seven times 44 times. You don't really anticipate them. You don't really give them any thought, you know, prior to. Uh, you hope maybe you'll get that opportunity again, but uh, that's all it is. And when you divide 939 by. Yes, I believe I deserve more money. And divide that by. Today. I'm the greatest of all time. Thank you. It becomes perfectly clear why, in the eyes of the sports world, seven is greater than 939. It's not fair to the man of steel. It's not what Nolan had in mind. But it's Nolanometry. It's history. It was Wednesday. That's when the sports world learned the basic postulate of the new man. When a legend grows exponentially toward infinity, seven is, in fact, greater than 939. I'm Bill Patrick, ESPN.